Good morning. Thursday, 26th of May, 2016. Just wanted to uh, make a quick video. A few things on my mind. And first thing I'll talk about is the number of people who think Jesus is God and the number of people making YouTube videos and then they say, you know, uh, declare your, declare that you love Jesus Christ or something or, you know, because that's the thing, people who are into the Jesus Christ thing, they always kind of say you just have to, you know, drink his blood <laughs> and eat his body and uh, say his name, I can't remember what they say, like declare your you know, allegiance if you like <clears throat> and you'll be saved. Oh, that's all you have to do. A yeah, good one. Right, so a lot of people think Jesus is God, okay? So I've got less of a problem with that. It's just, you know, so they, 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 they think he's God. So they're sort of declaring their love for him and and then in their hearts, you know, they're, they're doing it for God. But, I'll use a bit of scripture, you can't serve two masters. So if you've got two different names for God, um, you know, just pick one and, uh, and just have one name. And what's wrong with the word God, you know? So... I would, I would, you know, I'm going to definitely going to be picking people up on that in the comments. You can only serve one master, so why not say God? Why have to say this Jesus Christ name? So yeah, you know, it is uh, interesting, and um, I haven't explained that very well at all, have I? Never mind. So obviously I've been a bit, you know, what am I doing? Am I just been bullshitting? I've been I've been quite down to be honest for a, for a little period, sort of waiting for this earthquake, asking God why did you tell me that there's going to be an earthquake and, and then there isn't, you know? And I guess there could still be one, and it you could call that within the imminent time frame. It's plausible, but I think. Perhaps God was saying to me something about the YouTube. <laughs> don't, don't do any more videos, but uh, here I am doing a video. Weird, isn't it? I just carry on <laughs> ignoring, uh, ignoring your failures. Well, you know, I've still got a bit of enthusiasm, and that, that's, that's good to, to keep your enthusiasm. Um, also, we're in this... Fully into this time frame of May June 2016, which is the prediction I made last year, and throughout the whole year I was thinking it could be a year out. It could, it could, it could be a year out. It could be next. It could be all happening a year later. It could be seven years out, but I don't know. I think we struggle to make another seven years. It's. Uh, Anyway, all this shit could get, hit the fan any moment, or whatever. I mean, waiting for the end of the world is really boring. I've been waiting for the end of the world since 2011. <laughs> and it is quite frustrating, really. And also, the world isn't just going to end, and we don't want it to just end. What we want is it to change and not be the um, not be the greedy capitalist world that's raping raping the planet and, um, uh, yeah, that's why it's got to change um, I did have some other things to say
meditating last night and um, I was able again to concentrate on the heart, the heart of the soul, it's the power, it's where the power is and I think that's given me a bit of new lease for, for yes, carrying on doing it. <clears throat> um, yeah, I was going to say we're going to talk about smoking fags. Yeah. Now I've come to the conclusion again that they're good for you. <laughs> yep. It's sort of, um, I mean, if you smoke, if you've never smoked, I don't know, like, look into your mind, but there's something about control of your own thoughts. It's like, um, when you don't smoke, I don't know. This is the crappiest video ever. <laughs> I don't know. I just thought I'd bosh out a quick video before <laughs> before I got to go and do something. And I wanted to do. I wanted to talk about the smoking with someone, but uh, he he he's not available. My mate, who I wanted to to do it with, because he he gives up smoking for a few months and then he starts smoking again and like that. So I mean, if they and I've known people who they give up for eleven years, and then they start smoking again. Um, lots of people, you know, I know someone who's given up smoking through hypnotism, and is always twitching. <laughs> uh, weird. Um, <clears throat> And it's God-given plan, and it was, God is in control of everything, and here we are, you know, and tobacco is available. And when tobacco, well, in 1490, they went and got it, I don't know what people used to smoke before, they used to smoke something and stick it in a pipe and smoke it, I think. Or they just throw it on the fire and <laughs> breathe it in. But, um, yeah, because uh, it pacifies as well. And I wonder what the world would be like if it didn't have tobacco and all these people who, who, ha who have felt injustice in their life you know, there's so many people who will pacify themselves with the smoke. So if they didn't have that, what would they be doing? They'd be smashing things up, wouldn't they? And, um, you know, I've smoked since I was 12. I mean, it's, it's a bit stupid and smoke too much. <coughs> Get one of them. But I, that was the other thing, like, um, the other night I kind of gave up smoking <laughs> and then the next morning I woke up and I remembered, yeah, I'm giving up smoking. I couldn't cough, I couldn't grab that phlegm off my lungs, you know. And I, I've probably said this before, but um, they, they've used cigarettes. For people with TB in hospitals, they gave them a full strength capstan cigarette in the morning for people to be able to cough all the shit off their lungs. And I think these days with pollution and everything that you're breathing in, yeah, maybe even tobacco helps. So what I'm saying is God, God has allowed it to be here and Perhaps that was part of, for his specific, his, her specific plan, um, to help give people a bit of relief um, from the shit, so both to pacify them and to clear the lungs up. 
So, um, stick that in your pipe and smoke it. That's right. I've turned into an Irish person. <laughs> okay. Uh, so that was it. That was smoking. Do you? Um, I think that's all there is. I don't think I have anything else to say on the matter. So, but mainly this uh, Jesus and God. Pick one, yeah? You can't serve two masters. So you decide. Okay, that's it for now. I'll see you. Bye.